Hey everybody, this is Digby. I'd like to thank you all for stopping by, and today we are back having some more little nightmares. And we are, I had to replay slightly, but we are back where we left off, standing over, um, lunchtime the rat here, thinking, you know, yay! I'm still better at McDonald's, I bet. Uh, and, having done that, let's carry on. Let's see what's next. Find out who this big, fat, goofy-looking bastard we ran into up there was. I have learned my lesson here. I am not going anywhere. I'm not looking up first. Okay. That's it. Just kind of wander about. I mean, I'm glad if it is. I'm happy to have a... Oh, shoot. Oh. oh, you know what I bet? I bet that pushes over, doesn't it? Sneaking feeling. When in doubt, make a ramp. Well, maybe it doesn't. Okay. Huh. It moves. Oh, do I just have to hit it harder? What's the deal? Alright, let's try this. I have an idea. It's a bad idea, but I have an idea. Oh, it's, uh, it's not gonna work idea. Oh, there we go. Alright, see kids? Persistence pays off. Well done, Hermione. God, that's the least amount of struggle I've had with any puzzle in this game, apart from the Steam one. Even that, I died once just being an idiot. Oh, okay, so now we've spilled the red ink bottle instead of the black one. I gotcha. Uh, well, I don't think I've ever wanted to open a door less, but... In for penny, in for pound. And we are, after all, celebrating having an entire day, well, not an entire day, but an entire afternoon of recording time to play with. I am, in fact, on my third recording of the morning. This is quite nice. I've gotten um, Subnautica done, I've gotten Stranded Deep done, and now we're doing Little Nightmares. And yes, it was a pathetic excuse for me to just play. Well, I think we worked this one out from the Steam puzzle. Is it a push? It's a push. No, I don't want to put it that way. I just want to go... There we go. Sideways. Or is this something I was supposed to climb on top of and then deal with? Ah, nope, there we go. Huh. Well, we are cooking with gas today. That's not a good noise. That is a sound one can only describe as ominous. I'll tell you what, kid. You were happy to eat the rat. You want the carrot? Carrots are good for you. Can I eat the carrot? Oh, yeah, you'll eat a rat, but you won't eat a carrot. What the hell? I'm thinking I'm going to hold off on the lighter here, just in case. Alright, let's go see who's sharpening his axe. It's getting louder. Oh, can I go through the little hole? Because that sounds like a much better idea for me, honestly. Cool. Oh, what the hell? Great. It's the bloated corpse of Louis Anderson. Okay, shit, 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 please don't mess with me. Oh, welcome to the No Star Restaurant. Let's, let's get the hell out of it. Honestly, guy, if that's as bad as you get, I'll be totally happy. What are the odds he's going to be stalking us through the next 50 levels? Oh, yeah, run like hell. Thank you, you feckin' house elf. You got me killed. Oh, don't. No. Oh, Jesus Christ. Holy hell. Now, well, we've learned something there, I think. I'm gonna follow that little traitor of freaking house elf and see if we can't get out quicker than the fat boy can run. Now, he's pretty nasty looking, but he's still a much, much more attractive man than the goddamned uh, guy with the arms. Jesus. I, mean, I probably could have gone just then, but I do know you're about to do something horrible, so I'm gonna wait a minute. Why don't you grab your little steak over there? Or your salmon, whatever the hell it is. Go feed the pot. I thought every one of you could use a dermatologist, so Jesus Christ. 
You nasty. You are a nasty, nasty boy. He smells as good as he looks. Alright, you ready to get ratted out by the damned elf? You suck, elf. Yeah, kiss my ass. I'm out of here. I'm following you, house elf. Them look like stairs to me. Let's get upstairs. Oh, f*** me. You're kidding. Really? With the thing? Can I hide? Wanna play around Robin Hood's barn? Alright, so there's a key involved in this somewhere. What are you up to? Oh, we're gonna work in here now, are we? That's sweet of you. Alright, well, there's a lantern up there. I can't... shit. Let's just stay out of harm's way here for a minute. I can obviously climb up, but it looks like if I do, I'm gonna knock some shit over. Right, let's just real quick see if we can open this door. Nope. Back to safety, back to safety. Well, worth mentioning, he could not hear me run just then. Oh, because he was all the way to hell and gone over there. Back in the other kitchen, guy. Jesus. Yeah, I definitely talked to somebody about that asthma, too, I think. Right, what if we just climb up and knock crap over and then... I mean, what are the odds the key's, like, in that jar or something? Because there's a lantern we can light, so obviously we're supposed to go up there. You play with this counter one more time, and then you're gonna go over to the other side of the kitchen, and I'm gonna run like hell. How's that sound? You know your place in the world? I know mine. Let's do it. Oh, I wonder if we get up here. Can we? Yes, we can. Well, now. Shit. <laughs> okay. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. You can't see me, there's no doubt. I'm about to die, and that just sucks. Please don't look up. Please don't look up. Don't look up. Just don't look up. Don't look Ah, oh, thank God you're oblivious. Okay, let's not knock anything else over, Hermione. Jesus Christ. I have a sneaking feeling. I need to be over there. I did need to be over here. Perfect. Where the hell am I trying to go here? Well, we got two choices, down and out. So let's have a look over here. Get my trusty, dusty Zippo out again. Oh yeah, well, at least the food's better in this level than it was in the... I think it was the lair it said was the achievement I got, so I guess in the first bit was called the lair. Let's go over here. Yeah, we get hungry in this level. Of course, we ate a rat. We had to get hungry before we got to the restaurant. Anything in this one? I don't know. Let's find out. Nope. Pissed him off, though. <laughs> I think he's getting very irritated with me. Ah, alright. We got some stuff over here. You don't happen to have a key by any chance, would you? Ah, Jesus, that's awful close to the edge of the level. Okay, shit, are you on to me or something? Something's pissed him off. Oh, goody, we're safe. <laughs> Yay. Ah, okay, well, now what do we do? Got some soap. I can't help but think the way this thing is rocking, it's got to be a boat of some description. Alright, candle up there. I don't know if we can get up there to light it. Alright, can't climb the toilets. That's probably for the best, honestly. Well, let's carry on. Maybe the candle's just for decoration. Hmm. Alright, we got a door here. That was worth a try, right? Now, is there something in here I can actually drag around? Oh, you, you little rat fink traitor. I ain't real happy with you right now. Can I catch you? No. Nope. I'm gonna catch it and pull a little hat down around your ears. I should probably calm the hell down a little bit here with the whole running around the room thing, shouldn't I? Nope, well, we got a padlock. Door downstairs. 
we're running backwards, so maybe we have to do something. Oh, that looks like an elevator. Let's see how long you stay open. Let's see if there's anything else over here we need to worry about. Oh, another door. Hmm. Something in here is not bloody happy. Oh. Now, common sense dictates that we just not do what we're about to go do, but you know, if you're giving me a weird ass noise, I gotta know who's making it. You in here napping now? Yep, it's the big fat guy. Oh, you gotta be effing kidding me, really? Alright, well, we figured this part of it out. Oh, I see a cabinet over there, too. Alright, that's climbable. This is not. Can I grab the key from here, is the question. I can. Can I swing the key off the end? I can. Alright, climb, climb, Hermione. Climb. <laughs> Bastard. I was out. God damn ya. Oh, he let me go. Okay. I'll pretend you didn't see me. I'm fine with that. My dude. How the hell you didn't get me, I don't know. Go back to sleep, fat boy. Go back to sleep, Leo, will ya? Please. I'd call this one a Mexican standoff, wouldn't I? Alright, it looks like I can get out that way, so let's try that. Oh, we are really breaking his stuff up. Oops. Let me check on you, see what you're up to. See, I got miffed at the last guy, so I'm taking it out on you now. Yeah, I suppose. I can't get up next to damn, well, damn boxes, anyway. Right. Are you leaving? Oh, you're leaving. Thank Christ for that. Goodbye and good bloody riddance. I'm not sure exactly what happened just then, but... I'll definitely take it. <laughs> oh, come on, Key. I'm through a lot of grief for you. Can I kick the ball? Just curious. Yeah. Probably scored a goal there. I'm sure there was a quieter, safer, better way to do that puzzle, but... Eh, it's not the Digby way. Random acts of violence. That, that always works. Well, I know damn well... I think I came through a door, didn't I? Yeah, but how did I get in the toilet, is the question. I don't remember if that was... How did I get in the toilet? Alright, well, we'll see if we can get out this way, and if not, we'll just take the elevator. Is it through here? It's not a push. This is the you just gotta try it real hard thing? Nope. Alright. We'll give up. We'll take the elevator. It seems like the obvious solution, so... Why not try the obvious for once? I want you to notice, please, too, that that damned house elf led me into danger yet again. Okay. Is down really... Oh, you know what? You can totally kiss my Takis. I am less than impressed with you, my friend. Oh, hey, we're back in the kitchen, and I just saw the safe thing come up. Oh, yeah, she back at work over here now? I'm just gonna kind of eyeball the lay of the land here. I am not liking this at all. Can I get around through there? I have a sneaking feeling I need to get under that before he gets back. So let's grab our key. We'll have a wait. 
let him get in there, and then we will, as soon as he leaves, run under there and kind of see what we can f see. I really hope I'm doing this right, because I'm going to feel like a total numpty if I'm getting it wrong, as my buddy Fracture would say. This must be, these things must be like level bosses. Like this is the boss of this particular section. And then, I don't know how many sections there are, but I have a feeling I'm going to have to deal with somebody different every time. Let's get in there. Let's go scope out what's going on in there. I can probably hide behind the stoves. And just pick whatever side he doesn't go on sneak out past him. Oh, that would have been very, very bad. Alright, so you go wait in there. I'm going to be quiet and I'm going to think for a minute. We'll just watch him do shit. Alright, so from there, over to there. I don't know if you're back too right then. see yet. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not liking this idea. I can sneak behind you right then and duck down. Okay. How long are you in there? Shit, I should have waited. Alright, this is going to have to be quick, so we'll time this as best we can. Wish me luck. I went through a lot, and if I screw this up now, I'm going to be miffed. <laughs> Alright, you go over there. I'm going to get ready to run. Let's get out towards the edge a little bit. Right, keep a very close eye on you. Yeah, this is going to be a treat doing this blind. We'll, we'll do our best. We'll do everything we can do within our power to not die anymore in this episode. How cool is that? He's going, I'm going as well. Here we go. <laughs> Shit. Oh, you know what I did? I dropped the f key, too. Crapola. Relax, fat guy, relax. Shit. Mother f Okay, I needed to remember the key. Ah, bugger. Alright, where'd my key go? Where the hell's my key? I had the key. Where's the key? Really? You want me to free you? You know what? I'm mad at you. You deserve to be in jail. Oh, there's my key. Okay. Really? Ratted out by the damned house elf again? Saved the little bastard. That was epically unfair. here and come in. Alright, yeah, kill the house elf. Oh, he tripped over the damn key. Please don't notice the key. What the hell happened to the house elf? Did you just suddenly not give a shit? What? What? Okay, he ate the little bastard. Nope, didn't even touch him. I'll well, give you a hug. Maybe you'll be my friend. Maybe you can run interference for me in the next one. Shit! No! God damn it! <laughs> you owe me a hug after this. Yeah. Help me out now, buddy. You're not very bright, are you? Once more with feeling. Grab my key. Oops. 
Grab my key. Grab my key, Hermione. Grab the key. There we go. Okay. He's headed out, so I can go over here now. Pretty quiet walking like that. It's... I'd love to know what he's doing when he's over there, because it seems like it might be a good time to go in here. You know what? We'll have a go at it. We'll go around the other way. We'll see if we can do that. Maybe he's busy and he won't notice us. You can hear the sheer epic optimism in my voice that this plan is going to work. My confidence in my abilities is epic. Alright, do your thing. Oh, that's quite a waddle you've got going there. Alright, come on. Don't get stuck, Hermione. You could really use you moving now. If nothing else will get stuck. Oh, yes, chase the damned house elf. Really, you were just standing back to me the whole bloody time. Definitely gonna run now. Alright, let's take a breather. Oh, I don't see him. He might not like this, but I can run like hell at this point. And in fact, run like hell seems like a really good plan. Yeah, run like hell. Run it out. Okay. We're back to having more problems. Oh, never mind. Problem solved. I see the answer. I think. Shame I can't grab the cleaver. Uh, if only I was a wee bit bigger. I'd go in there and take his freaking head off. Eh. Problem solved. Alright, one second. I have to cough. There we go. Alright, the dumb waiter seems an obvious solution, but it's also drenched in blood, and that makes me a bit nervous. So let's just have a peek over here and see what's going on in this direction. Ah. Sausages. 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 <laughs> that was my impression of Paul Merton doing an impression of the dog because they sausages. Okay. You got the thing up there I can't get through. Am I going to need the dumb waiter? You know I'm going to try it, but there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to move this bench. Oh, I see a switch. And a crank come to that. Right, we'll try the switch first. Oh, this is promising. That's a sausage making machine. Well, let's make a sausage. See what happens. That was a singularly disgusting noise. Now, this time, let's pay attention to what falls out of the ceiling. Nothing fell out of the ceiling. Are we, we out of meat? Can I get the sausage any further along? Nope. Okay, well. Dumbwaiter time it is, I guess. Let's see what's in here. Ah, I cannot get... Oh, yes, I can. I get ratted out by a freaking house elf. Those are some big ham hocks. Yummy. Oh, I think I have a feeling this is what's going to be. I'm going to have to chuck this ham. I'm going to call it a ham, and so are you. I'm going to chuck this ham over the thing. Oh, can I get through that one as well? Okay, can I always take the dumbwaiter back, so let's have a peek in here. It seems a quiet place. Oh, a lantern we can light. Ah, and a bonus doll thing. Come here, you, whatever you are. And free the spirits of whatever the hell it is. Yeah, this was, reminds me of a laundromat, really. Okay, I guess we gotta go back out through the hole. That is fine. Mystery solved. We're gonna go back out through the dumbwaiter. Is there any other bonusy things in here or anything else I should know about? I mean, there's a hook I could probably jump onto. We'll try it. Why not? We got time to kill. We might as well have a little fun. I don't think I'll die if I screw this up. Anything? 
Anything? Nope. Okay. Bugger it. Let's move forward, shall we? Ooh, what a little trail of dust you left there, am I me? And back downstairs. Jump up here and let the hot dogs out. Yes, in my head I'm now singing Who Let the Dogs Out. <laughs> I hope I don't have to throw anything else gross in there. Now, why exactly do I have time for this anyway? Why am I helping the guy? Really? Nope. Oh, ah, fair enough. We'll just see if we can find something else to chuck in there. Come on, Hermione. Let's go take a really good look around, see if there's like three or four things in here we can chuck on it. Maybe. Any of you I can do? Nope. Anything over here? Nope. I just see the one ham hawk. That's not really helpful. Can push you out or do any of you? Nope. Hmm. Oh, maybe there was something in the meat hook after all. Maybe I'm supposed to unhook something. Oh, yeah, you know what? I bet you that's exactly what I meant to do. Alright, we'll go unhook the meat. Ah, shoot. I screwed that up. Alright, very carefully. See if we can do this this time. There we go. Oof. Ew. Nasty. Now, is there any more ham or anything else weird and gross I have to knock onto this effing thing? I don't want whatever the hell that is. I really don't want to make sausages with that. At least that I can pretend is ham. There we go. Oh, looks like it's snowing almost in here. I don't know what the payoff for this puzzle is going to be, but hopefully it's good. Give me one step closer to freedom at least. And hey, I'm feeling pretty good here today. We have struggled way less in this section than we did in the lair. Alright. Let's make some sausages. Oh, you... Oh, I know what it's doing. It's going to give me a... Freaking Tarzan vine, so I can get over there. Okay. Should have been more obvious. Oh. There we go. We're gonna get a save here in the near future. I have a feeling this episode's gonna run slightly long, and that's fine. I want to play this more and more anyway, and I know it's a relatively short game, so I'm just gonna go. No oh, goody, more dead people. Oh, we're in the meat cooler, or the freezer, because it is cold. Oh, you and your poor little bare feet, Hermione. Anything just out of curiosity? Nope. Probably hit the light just to make sure we're not missing anything. Alright, we got another switch. And we have another goddamn door of the padlock. Oh, joy. gotta be kidding me. What the f***? No, 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 no. God damn it. Okay. I have a feeling we're supposed to open that and then really take off. Right, let's go have a look. See if we can figure this out real quick before we call it an episode. So there's nothing I can do if I run back here, right? I mean, I can jump on that, but it's not going to help me considerably. Oh, I can hide in there. Is that going to be? Yeah. Alright, that's got to be my solution. We'll hide in that box. Assuming we can get out of here quick enough. So real fast. Alright, you're on your own, dude. I'm getting the hell out of Dodge before you get here. Come on. Get in the box, Hermione. As long as he doesn't ask himself what's in the box when minted.
You suck, dude. You really suck. You know what? You can go suck over there. I'm gonna go not suck over here. Don't bump into the door frame, Hermione. Just get the hell out of here. Suck it! Oh, wait. He might pull that switch and come back back to me. Okay. I see a door with a thing. Oh, up, up, up. Hermione, it's probably going back for him, so let's say we hide. Well now, I have a switch to push. Oh, we're back in the damn kitchen again. What the hell? Am I meant to find another key in that place? Alright, well, let's see if we can trip off a save point here somehow. Is he gonna leave the door open for us? He left the door open for us. What a nice guy. Alright, let's see what he's up to. Crap. Okay, let's go play hidey hole where a mouse. You can't see me, I'm a mouse. House in the house, my friend. I don't know about Captain Asthma Pants hearing me anytime soon. <laughs> well, I guess we're in a different meat room, so that's good. Yeah, I don't like the look of that cleaver, my friend. Oh, with alacrity, Hermione, let's just sail away, sail away. Right, let's go back in here. Oh, shoot. Alright, yes, I see the button. But you know how much I love a button pushing puzzle in this game. I also see a hook. I'll tell you what. We're going to do a strategic retreat as soon as we push this button. That'd be nice if I could just run up and push him into that goddamn thing. Yeah, I think I'm definitely disturbing his calm. And now what? What's your problem? Well, on that happy note... Okay, I know I'm going to have to replay a bit of this later. Um, when, you know, for the next episode when I get back to it. But we have gone over a bit, and I have no idea how long it is to the next save point. So I will leave it here. Um, I'm just glad I got to play today and do some more recording. And I have been Digby. I'm under here, if you're wondering. Hi. I have been Digby. I thank you all for stopping by. I really hope you're enjoying Little Nightmares as much as I am, because this game is an absolute blast. It's disgusting, and it's terrifying, but, oh, it's so much fun. Anyway, that was it. That was this video, and we will be back, well, you'll see this on Wednesday, either Wednesday or Thursday, and we'll be back the week after that to find out how this all plays out. And until then, I hope to see you there.